Former Chairman of Parliament's Finance Committee, Dr. Mark Esibebwa, has asked government to reconsider its original position on the debt exchange program, which seeks to restructure the country's domestic debt. The proposal by the government is meant to alleviate the debt burden in a most transparent, efficient and expedited manner, which would minimize the impact on investors holding government bonds. Under the domestic debt exchange program, local bonds will be exchanged for new ones maturing in 2027, 2029, 2032 and 2037 and the annual coupons will be set at 0% in 2023, 5% in 2024 and 10% from 2025 until maturity. But commenting on his Facebook page, Dr. Esibeboa asked government to pay all accrued coupons. He's also asking government to exempt pensions of public sector workers and also exempt collective investment schemes. In total, pensions of public sector workers amounts to about 27 billion CDs, whilst collective investment schemes total 5 billion cities. If government heeds to this call, it could ease the brewing tension between government and labor, which has already made known its intentions of staging a nationwide strike.